this video is inspired by people who want to lose weight, but also because I've been watching this life coach has been showing up on the global news feed with my gym, and she's just brutal. She's trying to tell people how to lose weight while not actually having lost any. Well, I've actually, I'm in shape, and I know what I'm talking about. First off, if you want to lose weight, don't think about losing weight. Think about getting healthy. You get healthy, you're automatically going to lose weight. So think about it that you're getting healthy. Your motivation should be that you're doing it for you, nobody else. You can't do this for your spouse. You can't do it for your friends. You can't do it for your in-laws. You can't do it for your parents. It's got to be for you and only you, and that is that, and that is your freaking motivation. Do what you love to do when you were a kid. What got you fired up when you were a kid? Was it playing hockey? Was it roller skating? Was it gymnastics? Was it tennis? Do something that you love to do. Also, accept the fact that this is not a fad. You're not going to lose 50 pounds in 10 weeks and keep that off. Drinking freaking fluid. Drinking freaking liquid shakes. And working your ass off until you feel like you're just broken and completely depleted. Because you're going to start up eating the same lifestyle as you did before. Because you didn't actually change your lifestyle. And so you're going to gain all of that back and then some. And it's going to be even harder for you to lose that weight. Because your body's just going to be hanging on to it. You have got to accept the fact that you're going to have to work out. And the way you're going to have to work out is you're going to want to have cardio fitness. You're going to want to have strength fitness. And you're going to want to have flexibility. So you're going to start, if it depends on where, where your level of fitness is. If it's really low, you're going to start walking. You're going to start lifting, walking for 20 minutes. You're going to start lifting light weights for 20 minutes. You're going to do 10 minutes of stretching. You could also mix yoga in there for um, using your body, your body's weight, um, for strength and flexibility and do some walking or, and start where you're at. You're going to have to be really honest with what you're eating. No more processed foods. No more eating fast food. You're going to want to eat a lot of protein, high quality protein, and you're going to want to put protein powder in your dry diet, drink lots of water, get lots of sleep. You're going to want to exercise five days a week. Get off the freaking computer. Stop making excuses. If you can play Facebook games and if you can watch TV and all that kind of crap, you can get out there and you can work out, even if you have to break it up into 40, or 30 minutes here and 30 minutes there during your day. But you can do that. Um, so much I want to say. You really have got to face the reality that it's not a quick fix. It's just not. It's going to take, it can take you a year to a year and a half to get, get to where you want to be at. It's not going to happen overnight. And it's probably going to be a bit painful. And, you know, you're not going to want to just plateau. You're going to want to keep pushing yourself. You're going to want to keep getting better. You're your, you're your own com competition. Don't compete with other people. Compete from where you were yesterday to where you are today to get better and better every day until the day you freaking die. Because it's not a diet. It is a lifestyle. And you have got to be willing to make a commitment to yourself and be really, really honest with yourself. Eating, Starting with eating one piece of fruit a day, that's just bullshit. It's bullshit. It's going to take a lot of hard work, and you're not going to deprive yourself. You're going to have one day a week where it's not binge eating, where you're going to give yourself something that you like so that you don't feel like you're depriving yourself. But you're going to be really honest with what you're eating and with what you're doing, and understand it's not about losing weight. First off and foremost, it's about getting healthy.